Okay, hi everyone. Sorry, my normal mic isn't working for some reason, so I'm using a slightly different mic. I hope that's okay. I apologize. Um, <laughs> hi everyone. So sorry for the delay, but yes, Charcoal is joining us tonight. Say hi, buddy. Hi, 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 Um, yeah. Good evening. So, <laughs> yeah, technical difficulties always kind of like you know, make me a little nervous, but um, thankfully I do have the at least basic knowledge to kind of like fix things and troubleshoot. So anyway, thank you for your patience. Um, hi, Linda. Hi, Rena. Yes, Charcoal's here. Yay. Um, yeah, tonight we're going to be painting, or I mean, I'm going to be painting pomegranate and i'll be honest just like some of the other fruits i'm a little nervous because pomegranates like if you've ever cut one open or seen a sliced pomegranate like it's got all those tiny little seeds and i'm like oh my god how am i going to paint that especially with gouache um i know i've gotten a lot more comfortable with it and so i do feel like half confident <laughs> um I'm, I'm more of a glass half full person so i'm gonna say i'm half confident and not half not confident if that makes sense so yeah i've already sketched out my painting so we'll just go ahead and get started with our breathing exercise because since i started with a lot of um anxiety trying to get my mic working i could definitely use the breathing exercise to help me calm down so maybe you're in the same place too or feeling the same way so use this time to yeah just kind of like center yourself and um you know just remind yourself that everything will be okay and even if things continue to go wrong you know try to have a positive um approach and a positive mindset and attitude about it um Ooh, yay, Rena. Yay, you're going to uh, paint, paint pomegranates with me. Yay, that's awesome. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started with our breathing exercise. Let me bring us back together. That felt really good. I don't know about you. And I think at some point I did feel like a sense of like calm, you know, like I was breathing in and out and things like that. And then at some point I was like, okay, it's going to be okay, you know? And yeah, even though I said pomegranates are hard, I'm going to walk into this with a more positive attitude and I'm ready. <laughs> so I hope you guys are doing well. If you're catching the replay, um, yeah, thank you so much for watching. Um, again, these are these sessions are not necessarily tutorial. Actually, they're not tutorials at all, um, but they're really just a creative time to carve out during your day or evening and to set aside so that you can allow yourself to be creative. Sometimes we allow our busy schedules to take over and so this time is just dedicated to reserving that creative time just for yourself today is day 57 i know i say it every time but i can't believe it <laughs> so yeah here we go and i'm so glad i bought that 
opera opera color remember i was saying that there's no bright pink color so here it is i'm so glad i got it i'm gonna maybe mix it with this color or or this color what do you think they're both very similar this might be too orange so maybe i might do a mixture of these two just to, you know just to get that like bright bright red slash pinkish pomegranate color and then some more green for the leaves so this will be a nice contrast page to these cucumbers one moment as i put charcoal down what here you go charcoal i know all right. Okay. Well, let me just get myself set up here. Oh, Rena, I'm sorry you had an anxious day as well. Yeah, I know we have those days, right? And yeah, even though we were breathing like just for a minute or so, Sometimes that's really just what we need, you know, so um, I'm glad it was helpful. And as we walk into this session, I hope you feel even better afterward. <laughs> okay. Well, I will see you in a little bit. <laughs>
Hi everyone, welcome back. Hi. Oh, thank you, Linda. <laughs> yeah, I'm kind of surprised at how it came out too. I think the only thing I would quote unquote improve for next time is make this yellow part a little bit wider, like whiter, not wider. <laughs> um like it's a little bit too yellow, you know what I mean? But at the same time, the bright yellow kind of makes it look more graphic. So I'm not complaining, but if I were to redo it, I would just do more like a, more like a cream color. Um, Rena, um, yours got quite abstract. That's okay. Oh, you got distracted to repot your succulent. Hand in the dirt creative. That's great too. I think that's a great way to be creative. I love, you know, plants. I have probably i don't know how many i like it i haven't counted in such a long time but i probably have like 30 40 house plants or so and so i totally understand like having to repot and and then you get distracted and then you do something else and then i, I totally understand <laughs> that's me too um yeah thank you yeah like i said just a little bit lighter but other than that like i'm really happy with how it turned out like the seeds i was definitely nervous and then i made these two the seeds like way too small and then i got a little bit bigger as i got over here so yeah i'm really happy um, so let's take a moment just to affirm ourselves. Um, I mean, even if you were just repotting your succulents like Rena, like that's being creative and doing something with your hands, you know, just getting off the phones that, you know, well, I mean, you have YouTube up, but, but I mean, you know, um, like you're not really uh, being distracted by other things, but just doing something tactile with your hands. And I feel like that is something that we're missing nowadays, like, I mean, not completely, but you know, like, I mean, I find it hard too. I find it hard not to be on my phone. So um, having these times of just painting is really good even for me. So let's take a moment just to affirm ourselves for showing up and for doing something creative, whether you painted something, drew something or just gardening. <laughs> so take a moment. Yeah. Okay. Well, thank you so much for joining tonight. Um, please make sure to give this video a like. And if you're watching the replay, let me know in the comments if you've you know painted pomegranates before. What uh, what problems you may have come across or how did you paint those tiny little seeds let me know and next week I'm going to be live uh, Monday Tuesday and Wednesday so Monday Tuesday Wednesday um, yeah very excited I think I'm going to continue with the fruit theme but i'm also going to try to do some vegetables so i know some of you have you know written me comments or emails or even posted on the community tab about which uh, vegetables that i should do so i'll definitely take a look um, next week i think i already have some of them scheduled so i think next week i'm painting like grapes and another kind of berry oh and mangoes so yeah i hope you'll still join me next week monday tuesday wednesday um yeah have a good evening again take some time for yourself even this weekend to be creative do something with your hands and um yeah it's just spend time away from your phone or go outside um that'll just be really good for your creative soul so thank you again so much for joining i'll see you guys next week bye